Can you explain the dog? Huh? Can you explain? I think the dog. The, the dog is is, is 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 a mentality. You know that no, and under any circumstances, are you going to break me? I'm going to win. I'm going every play. Even if you knock me down, I'm going to get back up. I'm going to come at you the same full tilt all day. And when adversity strikes, you still don't drop your head, and you got that mentality that I'm going to beat you this play. If you beat me, oh, the next play, oh, it's on. Glass Do eaters. it again. You know what I mean? So Glass eaters. That, that's what, like, we're looking up right there. Kevin Garnett. Dog. 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 All-time dog. What's All the Mount Rushmore dog. of dogs? Ooh, that's tough. That's tough. I would say, you know, okay, let's just throw out a couple from each sport. Lawrence Taylor. Dog. Dog. One that just uh, retired. Aaron Donald. That is a dog. Ray Lewis. Dog. Rodney right. Harrison. Dog. You know what I mean? Because I'm telling you, I'll say Rod Harris because Rod Harris is supposed to be in a pro football Hall of Fame. Dogs, no, no, no. I'm, what, what, <laughs> I, I, I'm going there. I say, I say, okay, no. Hey, <laughs> Jimmy it. Smith, dog. Julian Edelman, dog. Yeah. And not just because of, you know, I like that the journey too. Yeah. Okay, you can make plays, you can do all this stuff, but to know how tough he was to be able to go out there and do that and go out there and do what I do. I, I, I told Troy Brown, you got me fired, dog. Because when I got hurt, <laughs> here come Troy Brown playing DB, you know, and, and did some dog shit, picking stuff. He led the league, he led the team in picks, you know, you know what I mean? So when I you guys when you guys come in and, and, and do that and can do more than just your job and you do it with so much passion and you're successful, because no one expected you to be who you are. Maybe you expected it, but when you got drafted, or you, did you get drafted? Yeah. Okay, seven. okay you went seventh round. Damn it, that's basically a free agent bullshit. Yeah, basically. <laughs> but, you always but, but no wish you were a free agent because you don't have to do two years. Huh? It, it, exactly. You get, they but, get you for four. But no one expected you when they brought you in. They didn't expect you to turn into that. Only person that, that can believe that is a dog, and you got to believe in yourself because basically when you get drafted that late, you're coming from another position, you are basically there for a tackling dummy. Yeah. You're there Can't for guys. You're there, there for guys like somebody established like myself he to beat up on. Exactly. So for you to make it, you know, you a dog right there. And then to put out there and perform, and then you had some of the top corners out there that didn't want to see him. So that right there, you fit in the dog. Tom Brady was a dog. Dog. Because from day one, he came in there and he wanted to compete. He gonna talk shit, and I'm telling you, we used to light him up. But he coming right back at you as a dog, going to head bunch you. He going to fight you, come at you, and he was not no punk. And that's what, you know, then it, it, he ain't no punk right there. That was like a compliment. Oh, he ain't no punk. You know, nowadays it's like he ain't no bitch, but uh -uh. he ain't no punk. <laughs> you yeah. know what I mean? So that was uh, uh, Tom. I look at, like, receivers. Like, again, Heinz Ward was a dog. He dog. wasn't fast. Dog. He wasn't it, but he will – sit there and rock you, you know what I mean? He will blindside the shit out of you too. So you always got to keep your head on the swivel. So I look at at the tough guys. Even, <laughs> even you know, like I said, T.O., Randy Moss was a dog. You know what I mean? Because he, he was tough. Chris Carter, Michael Irvin, he will fight you all damn day too. You yeah. know what I mean? So I look at so many tough guys, but like just skill, everybody ain't a dog, man. Now are you, no, are you born with a dog or can you develop the dog? Because I'm sitting here looking at my seven-year-old daughter and I'm seeing some of this attitude and effort on the field right now. Yeah. And I'm like, I don't know if we got dog in her. <laughs> <laughs> we, got, we got puppy. You know what? We you might know have what? puppy in her. My, 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 mom, my mom told me, you know, when I was uh, younger, she said, you I'm know young. you used to get your ass whipped. You know, you wasn't, you wasn't that tough. But and, you know, I remember one time that I came home grinding, and she made me go back out there and fight. You know, yeah. like you gonna you gonna go out there and, and, and fight, and I started developing. So yes, you can develop DD. a dog, and you get, you can you develop can dog. Yeah, develop the dog. Uh, yeah. Develop I mean, you could you could be born into that's it too. That's a T-shirt. That's a game that's a T-shirt, shirt, baby. T-shirt. <laughs> develop. It's a tie log T-shirt. <laughs> yeah. That's right, baby. So I, I developed over time, and you get that confidence, and then it's like when you realize that you got to believe in yourself. That was my whole thing was always believing in myself, with no matter what anybody thinks. That's that's what a dog is. A dog is someone who believes in himself no matter what the situation right, is. Right, absolutely. If the situation is against you, if the world is against you, right. still still think you're going to do it. Because yep. when you stay ready, you ain't, ain't got to get, get ready. ready. Yeah.